Uh, in my last video, I talked about how to set SMART goals and what are the three important questions that you can ask yourself. This video is going to go deeper into those three questions and help you to understand how to align your goals. Um, when you know that your goals are aligned with your core values, you will never ever go wrong in your life. So stay tuned to this video if you would like to know these three important questions and develop a skill of aligning your goals in your life with your values so that you will never ever go wrong. The first important question to ask yourself is what is the relationship of your goal with yourself? This is a key question that you can't stop asking yourself every time you want to set a new goal or you want to take a new direction in life because if you ask this question it will connect you with your deeper sense of self it will relate your goal to yourself your needs your wants at the deeper level when you ask this question uh, what is the relationship of my goal with myself it will let you explore the parts of you which you might not have explored earlier on so asking the question of the relationship is very important let's take an example let's say you want to make new friends uh, we may have this idea that i want to make new friends because uh, something in me is telling me that i need more friends i need to share more but if we do not explore our goal in a meaningful way and by trying to relate it to our sense of self we might not be very clear about why do we want to make new friends so when you ask this question what is the relationship of this goal to myself you might come up with a few answers one of the answers could be hmm, let's say like I want to socialize more could be your answer a your answer B could be I would like to know new people more your answer C could be that I am an introvert and I think I need to develop my skill and try to go out and meet as many new people as possible so that I am developing something new because I feel as an introvert I'm missing out on a lot of opportunities in life so when we look at the three answers what stands out to me is answer C because answer A says that I want to socialize more answer B says that I want to know more people but somehow they are not helping us to relate to our goal of making new friends in as deep manner as our answer C because answer C is helping us to see that by taking this action I'm adding some value to myself I'm adding some value in my life all my actions energy will not go waste I will benefit something I will gain something I will add on a new skill and so this question is very important whichever you want to do in life go ahead and ask this question what is the relationship of my goal to myself because nothing is important more important than you and yourself in the world and now let's head on to the second important question that you may ask yourself while setting your goals the second important question is what is the relationship of my goal to others you have already asked what is the relationship of your goal to yourself who is the most important person in your universe. Now you are asking the second question what is the relationship of my goal to others. You cannot avoid asking this question because you as a social brain as a social human uh, nature are as much related to others around you as you are to yourself so you cannot evade overlooking others around you asking this question allows you to see how your goal is going to serve some kind of value to other people in your life or other people around you being of service is of paramount importance because it allows you to meet your higher purpose and when your goal is aligned with your higher purpose and your 
you're able to embed meaning in your goal, uh, which meets your heart purpose, there's no looking back because uh, this goal is inherently a good goal. You will never go wrong in setting up this goal. So asking the question, what is the relationship of my goal to others is a key question to ask as well on your list of aligning your smart goals. Let's take an example we took in our first question that I want to know more people, I want to socialize more and our answer told us the value I was going to meet is to develop skills that would allow me to add on to my personal level of skills. And when we ask this question in relationship to others, it allows me to answer that uh, being an uh, Expanding my skills on socializing will allow me to communicate more with the people around me and in this way I would be able to share my gifts and talents with more people around me. So when you are able to see a value in your a value in your goal, it will uh, give you that kind of intrinsic push and intrinsic motivation to move forward in your life and that push, that moving forward through your intrinsic motivation is very very important thing to happen in your life to allow your life force energy to move automatically on autopilot towards your goal i don't believe in willpower because willpower will play its role when you do not have an intrinsic motivation then you will bring your willpower into question but I believe that when you know your goals your goals are aligned with your core values and they meet their heart purpose we don't need to bring in willpower willpower is not needed because you're automatically <coughs> getting a flow of energy that is pushing you towards your life goal without effort there is so much fun there's so much ease and there is so much energy that is getting released from your core automatically and that is something that we desire that's something that each one of us want it is something like a state of flow the same state of flow that you find yourself in when you are doing the things you love doing the most so when we create our goals and our goals are allowing us to know how much we are in love with them how much we are passionate about them that is of utmost importance so go ahead and ask your question next time you are planning to set your goals now this brings me to the third important question to ask which is quite related to what i was talking about a little while ago about that passion about releasing your energy on autopilot and this question is how does my goal make me feel now feeling is important feeling is important because when your goal is making you feel good about it when you're feeling passionate about what you're going to do when you have already explored and analyzed its relationship how is it going to serve you how is it going to serve others around you and you can see a meaning and value in that it makes your goal much more meaningful you can see the meaningfulness and purpose of your goal and and if it is making you feel good it, and you're passionate about what you are about to do, you are experiencing a kind of freedom. You are experiencing a kind of autonomy in your life. You are not doing things because you need validation from others around you. You're not doing things because they would make somebody in your life happy. You are purely motivated by your passion you're purely motivated by your intention to do it and nothing can pull you back from back from such goals so it's very important that the goals we are setting they are coming from our pure intentions and those pure intentions have clarity those pure intentions are aligned with our core values those pure intentions are um, are very much connected with our sense of self because when we create an intention we have to be very very careful 
uh, we are very powerful we are magical beings and that's where like we hear all that magic happening about secret power of creating manifesting because yes we do have a power of manifesting and it's purely based upon our intentions what intentions are we creating so we must be very careful about the intentions we are creating in each moment the more consciousness you will infuse into your intentions and the more empowerment you will develop develop in your ability to make decisions in your life which will be guided and led by uh, your power to align your goals with your passions with your high purpose and you will never ever go wrong in your life and that's what we all need in order to uh, expand ourselves in order to feel more happy in our lives in order to feel more balanced in our lives that's what we all of us need so that's about today's video on how to align your smart goals so that you do not regret and feel frustrated ever in your life if you would like to stay tuned to the videos I make on upgrading your skills and on self growth mindset you do stay into my blog at www.ashumodgill.com and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i will be in touch with you in my next video till then all of you stay motivated try to create goals which are aligned with your core values